So here we are. We're a little early to pick up a prescription, and so we decided to go on a little adventure. Boats! Okay, okay. So, today was kind of a weird one, as was basically all of July so far. <laughs> so, um... And I say July in general because it was kind of just a month of unwanted information. It was a month of half-truths, and I'm not going to get into that because that's actually kind of a political sort of thing, and I've been trying very hard to not be political on this channel. And then there is just the mental barriers that I set up for myself that prevent me from sort of doing sort of things. So let's go into today. Today was weird just because, like you saw earlier, we went in for a prescription pickup because this morning was super weird with trying to confirm whether or not the prescription was ready to pick up or if it needed to be picked up later. You know, there was like a bunch of robots and then there were a bunch of people who said that they would call back and they just never did. So we just ended up physically going to the place and we ended up there early. <laughs> um, and then on my side of things, I decided that um, July was pretty in the middle of the year like if you kind of separate things into um categories it's like there's four sets of three months right three six nine twelve and july is kind of in that midsection so i decided you know what if i'm going to make any sort of investment any sort of progress then this month is probably going to have to be the one that i'm gonna have to make it in because if it comes during this month that's awesome if it comes next month then i'm gonna have to hustle just a little bit but i'd have made that investment so i decided to look around for just one last little gander into like the gpus and just to see like what could i shove into my computer but i just couldn't help myself but look at just pre-built pcs in general and so i landed on this one by nzxt and some people out there might be like oh gross why would you go with that um price mostly and there's going to be some of you out there that are going to be like oh again why would you go with that one um also because i'm not really familiar with what's called um what oh shit what do they call that um tank builds aquarium <laughs> builds um just where the case itself is super open and it allows for my arms to really sort of fit into that work environment the alienware aurora r7 what are you r5 no that's not true anyways um if any google search is made of that make and model um, for a visual comparison, it's here. So if I get the title wrong, then that's my fault. But here's a visual to compare it to so you can get the correct sort of thing. Um, the work environment in there is very claustrophobic and makes it kind of hard to get into the vibe of building pcs and customizing it <laughs> and it's not something that i wanted to get into but it's something that's kind of piqued my interest a little bit just to be like hey so how could i improve my specs and that opens up a lot of opportunities for like just the thought process of like okay how can i improve this stuff and 
the PC that I'm currently recording off of, the Aurora, I'm going to keep saying R7, but for some reason I want to say there's a 5. In any case, um, it that is a like 8-year-old PC now. Uh, 2017, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Yeah, it's pretty much an eight-year-old PC right now. And most people that I talk to kind of assume that that thing is going to either explode on me at some point or like a flat tire is going to just fail on me at some point. And I'm not wholeheartedly arguing with them. <laughs> so this is a progression that I feel is sort of necessary at this point. Um, there's a lot that I can do on the build that I'm currently on. Like I am amazed at what that can do, but um, Blender has really sort of illuminated its, its shortcomings. And that's just Blender. There's a lot of different video games that are being produced today. There are a lot of different, um, especially when it comes to like, not so much Unity, but like definitely Unreal Engine. Um, they sort of really kind of make it known that my setup is outdated. It's possible, but just know that it's outdated one of those things. So, um, yeah, I, I did the thing. <laughs> um, I pressed the button and sometime next month, um, the estimated shipping date, I think was the 18th, I believe. So that is an investment that I committed to because if I can't get a new Valve headset, come on, give us the Index 2. Where's the Deckard? Um, then at the very least, I'm going to progress what I can do and what I know in the 3D aspect. So Blender mostly, but also Unreal 5 and in some aspects Unity, I guess. But Unity hasn't given me as many problems, so there you go. Monday.